How do you self-sabotage? You self-sabotage because you made a decision a long time ago to never be vulnerable again. It was an unconscious decision, a decision you probably don't remember making in reaction to something that happened to you as a child that was overwhelmingly painful. So painful you resolved to never feel it again by refusing to do anything that might bring about that pain. So you vowed to never again ask for what you need. Never open your heart. Never trust. Never be here all the way. Never show the truth of who you really are. It was the perfect way to protect yourself and regain some control at a time when you felt powerless. The trouble is that decision, that defense, is still running your life with vigilance. So when you reach for love, for growth, for expansion, that part of you wakes up thinking you're in danger and puts a stop to it through procrastination, addiction, isolation, avoidance, perfectionism. But it's really just fear fear of being hurt again. The realization is the understanding that even though the child could not feel that pain, you as an adult can and you must if you want to live, love, and be free.